Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we're playing some of The Walking Dead, the final season. I can't believe we're at the final season guys, we're at the final chapter with our little Clementine. I'm honestly quite nervous to see what happens in this game. I have no idea what the end is going to be, no inkling as to what it could be. So that's why I'm so nervous. If anything happens to her, I'm going to be so upset. Or if anything happens to AJ, I'm going to be so upset. Surely, I just don't want them to die. I don't want them to die. I feel like Clementine really doesn't deserve it. She's been through so much shit. So guys, all we can do is play it and find out. Before we get started, a quick shout out to Patreon of the day, Casey Mitchell. Thank you so much, Casey, for increasing your pledge. You have been around on the channel a long time and you've supported me so much, like monetarily, through Patreon and in the comments in general. So I'm really appreciate appreciative of you, Casey. So thank you so much. If you're interested in becoming a Patreon, the link is in the description. And so guys, let's get into the gameplay. Mwah. Okay, so there's four episodes. We're looking here. See that makes me nervous because in the first three already, you you see Clementine and AJ together, and in the final one, all you see is her hat. So I'm not gonna lie, I'm already like, what the fuck? Let's do this, guys. I should put subtitles. I always forget. I'm sorry. I put them on in a minute. Dead started walking. I was small and alone until a man named Lee, Lee became my protector. Lee protected other people too, but he couldn't save everyone. I honestly can't remember. For some reason, my save went in port, but I'm pretty sure he saved Carly. <laughs> you can never save everyone. The living were just as dangerous as the dead. But it's cool you can actually change your choices now. Lily lost her dad, and then she just couldn't cope. She took the life that Lee saved. Ah, uh, yeah, I remember now. I definitely saved Kara. And we, we left her behind. We were like, bye, bitch. Lee left her on the side of the road. Lee taught me how to survive. He protected me as long as he could. But he got Shut bit. Shut up, PC. Because of me. Not because of you, Clementine. But even in the end, he was still teaching. Keep your hair short. Keep that hair short. Just not worth the risk. My hair is not short as you can see. He wouldn't make it. <laughs> he knew it was the end. He made one final request. He asked me to shoot him. And I did. I met another group after that. Broken people, running from their past. There was a woman who gave birth to a boy named Alvin Jr. AJ, he made it. But the mom didn't. And I started to take care of him. But then, Jane left AJ in the snow. Oh my god, Jane! Was gone forever. And then I shot was the last straw for I Kenny. shot Kenny! And without Lee around, I had to make the call. Oh god, and then I shot him. I cried so much, but I feel like it was the right time for him. And when you look at season three, and the way they killed Kenny off, it's just so much better for you to shoot him than to him be paralyzed. Like, well, hang on, let me just shut my window. There's a really annoying beeping outside. I stopped Kenny. Honestly, it was horrible. Peace. I cried so much. Everyone it lost their shit. AJ was alive. Jane hid him to make a point. Knowing what they'd done. I th I want to say it went on alone. Let me just double check this. Yeah, I, I went on alone. I'd had enough. Bye, bitch. I took AJ and left them behind. AJ and I traveled to a new frontier. I thought we'd found something that worked. But I was wrong again. They took AJ from me. Said I was too young to take care of him. 
fought for him. I fought back, but I wasn't strong enough. I searched for a long time. Just when I gave up hope, I found him. We're searching together now for a place we can call home. I'm all AJ has. He's all I have. And I'll protect him with my life. Just like Lee did for me. So much has happened. It's crazy. The past three seasons. He's come so far, my little Clementine. Oh, God. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play, as usual. And then we just put on subtitles. I'm not in control. Um, audio. On. Here we go. Beautiful. To adjust my rear view mirror. Oh, you need to go. Ah. What are you doing? You're playing with a gun! Just kids your age be doing that. What you doing there, goofball? Playing Russian roulette, is it? You know we got bullets. Well, don't. It's getting on my nerves. I don't like goofball. Oh. I'm too big for it. Someone's all huh, grown up. So I guess you're all grown up now. Yep. <laughs> Let me drive. No. I'm not letting you drive. You hungry? What's wrong? AJ? Hungry. Give toy. Give them the magazine. Here, practice your reading. But I don't wanna. It'll take your mind off your stomach. Preheat oven. <laughs> it's a cookbook. Place cream, vanilla be beans into a saucepan and bring to a boy uh, on second thought never mind that's only gonna make you hungrier should we give him a snack here you go about all we got what about you go for it we'll find something else soon I believe you. I feel like if I gave him the toy, he would have been offended because he was like, oh, I'm all grown up, I'm not goofball anymore. So if I gave him the toy, like, here, play with this toy, he would have been like, fuck you. <laughs> I'm already loving this game and I've only been playing it for like five minutes, guys. I love the whole flashback thing as well, where you could potentially change the choices, but I kept all mine. Because I think I made the right choices all along. Even though for a while I doubted my Kenny choice, after seeing how he died in season 3, or whatever, which season he died in. I feel like it was worth it. We gonna do it? Think so. Looks clear. We're doing it.
friendly ring bell. But wouldn't that bring in zombies if you rang a bell? Grab pry bra. Pick up canteen. Look at toy. Obviously, I'm going to go for the bar so I can bash a zombie's head in. If we find some water, I guess. We need water, too. Had water in days, honestly, I would die. I drink so much water. Right. Find Let's food. Find some food. I honestly love it when zombie games make finding water and food a massive deal because it's just so much more realistic to me. I just fucking love it. I don't know why. I love zombie games, but I love it even more when they're realistic and you need to like do things for survival, which you'd need to do in the real world. And obviously food and water would be a massive struggle. There's a zombie over there. AJ, stay back. I'm not just gonna stun it. I'm gonna fucking kill that bitch. It's down. Still with me? Still here. No bites. You yes, better not. Get in there. Can we loot the zombie though? Hold R1 to run. I'm just gonna. Whoever used to grow things here is long gone. Nothing we can salvage. There's something in the trees, which is a bit concerning. Can't see anything though. I'm not gonna go inside yet. Oh, do you wanna have a go on the tire swing? Monster trap? <laughs> it's not a trap. You swing on it. For fun? You get in the tire and someone pushes you so that you go really high. I want to try. After we clear this place. Oh, what a good, what a good boy! He wants to after we clear the place. Good thinking, AJ. I was about to full on go for it, but you did the smart thinking there. What a deer skull? Hmm, interesting. Put on our car. Possible hood ornament, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Can we open the bins? No, okay, right. Let's head into the house. I'm gonna have this, like, sort of free roam ish, I guess. Not really, but you can look around more than you usually can, which I'm enjoying. Is this a water tank? Uh, uh, is it gross? Drink water. I mean, yeah, it looks fucking grim. <laughs> Undrinkable? Okay, then. Good thing you spat it out. Right, how do we get into this house? See if we can't open the door. I'll pry open door. That would make sense. Um, here we go. Stay back. What do we do inside a new place? We listen for monsters. Yes. After that? Uh... Come on, you remember. We... Inside a new place? Find a way Find out. Find a way out. out. That's right. AJ is always listening. Oh, bless him.
Honestly, to survive on the road this long, they've done fucking well. Monsters. All tied up. They can't get us? We're gonna kill them anyway, surely. Ain't worth the risk. No, they can't. Hmm. Your choice is determined what he will way. become. This one's locked. Security door. Hmm. Can't pry that open. I know you're hungry. I am too. We'll find something. I promise. Oh, he's so sad. He's hungry. But I really want to kill these. Like, just, just don't leave them alive. Come on. Poison. Guess they, they killed give themselves. Up? They wanted to leave this world together, holding hands in their own home. That's sort of sweet. Will we have a home? We'll see. Read note. Please leave us alone. This is what we wanted. Okay, let's see what Ooh, what's this? I got this opens the lock. Oh, God. <sighs> That's not happening. We need to kill them. Do we get the key? Mm, it's risky. We'll kill them! Way through that door. Like, just stab them in the head, they're Let's tied up. Let's be smart. That's right. Are these all eaten? Looks like it. Kent, there's no option to just stab. Here. They ate well for their last meal. Those selfish bastards. Beans! <laughs> Homemade. Might be more where this came from. Yeah, a bit of a jar of beans! Well, at least we've got something out of this. Let's check on AJ. How you doing, boy? Boy. Still hungry. Their facial expressions are so good in this game. Can we just push AJ through here? <laughs> like through you go, it's son. Small to crawl through. Well, for me. The key or the window. Those are our options. I wouldn't. If, it's dark in there. If I was Clementine, I wouldn't put AJ through that. We should kill the monsters. Yeah. They're not people. That's what I was thinking. Well, they used to be people. And as people, they ask to be left alone. So what's you, you gotta be ruthless though. There's no point in risking AJ's life and making him crawl through the hole. Kill the couple. I'll get the key. Like it's a bit savage, but they're dead. They're not I'm sorry. alive anymore. They're zombies. And honestly, if I was made a zombie, I'd want to die. I wouldn't want to, like, be tied up in a chair forever. Good job. this way I'm, I'm feeling like most people would have picked that choice it's no it's not worth risking AJ's life huh they had a good thing going here can we stay here We'll see. No one's here. 
No one's ever anywhere. It's always just monsters. I'm him. I'm here, kiddo. I know. Are <laughs> you saying I'm not someone? That's not what I mean. Singular bullet. Just a few. Age is a great shot. Remember what we said? You know this. Save the last bullet Save for yourself. Save the last bullet for myself. That's right. Come on, let's keep looking. There's gotta be something we can eat. Hope so. We need to have some homemade beans. We've got a nice little mattress. Didn't see a kid. Maybe no. they escaped. No, we didn't. Might be why they gave up. <sighs> Spoiled. Sorry, buddy. These are long gone. Fuck. Yeah, fuck's you right. Said it, kiddo. Shit, fuck. <laughs> Look. Huh. It's covering something. Something under here. Oh man, if it's a food storage place, that's gonna be sick. To be fair, this place is pretty decent. Cause you also have like the little fire thing there as yeah. well to keep warm. I must have wanted to hide something. <gasps> Jackpot. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, it is. We could eat for weeks with this much. <gasps> Grenade! Shut, 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 shut the door! It's rigged! Ah! <gasps> AJ! Of course. I'm loving the graphics in this game as well. The graphics are very cool. Monster. We need to get out of here. Fuck. Okay, we need to get back to the car. Oh shit. What to do? Stick to the sides and be my eyes while I clear a path. Go, 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 go. Um, stab him with the key, yeah. Oh, ah! Come on, let's go. Drive! God. No! I'm already stressed. I'm very stressed. Oh my god, this is so stressful. This is so stressful. We need to get out and run. Oh 
one. It. I'm glad I killed them. What assholes? Ugh. I'm mad. So selfish. Help. They're taking him. AJ. As if they've taken AJ. And left me behind. <laughs> Why is everyone being so mean in this world? Okay, I get it, it's a zombie world. But like, why did that couple rig it? That honestly makes no sense. season I'll probably end up splitting this up into two parts guys this episode depending on how long it is but it seems like we got rescued as well we were also handcuffed Can we use anything to store it off? Or just tear it off? Great handcuff! <laughs> Let's have a look around. They patched me up. It's pretty nice of them. Memories. Siblings, family, best friends forever. A lot of noise going outside the room. Some pencils, another bed, calendar. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? Can we get a chair to like? We can examine it. Just grab it now. <coughs> yeah, I thought it would be too short. I feel you, Clementine. I feel you. Let's move this chair. Being a bit snoopy here, but you you got to be. This'll do. Yeah, that'll do for a friggin' 
weapon palette knife is sharp enough. I'm really loving this the slight changes they made with this game so far. The graphics are beautiful. I'm loving the different. Oh, hang on, we've already, we've already looked at that. Um, they're different. It just feels different, but in like a really great way. Fuck you. <laughs> Oh, which way do we go? I mean, this one seems like a dead end, so we'll go down here first. And check the doors. Nothing over here. That's because I haven't finished looking yet, Clem. Let's see if we can open these doors. Nothing on that one. Or this one. <coughs> Nif keys in the holes. Could probably unlock them if you wanted to, Clementine. <laughs> okay, let's go this way. a little kid. I'm right here. <gasps> Put down the knife. But you do the same. We're not gonna hurt you. We've got your boy, he's safe. <laughs> I'll take you to see him. Just drop it. Your turn. What is that hairstyle? See, we're not going to hurt you. I'm Marlon, the little guy's Tennessee. Ten, for short. He's the one been taking care of you. He, uh, doesn't talk much. Can we say thank you? Clementine. Sorry about locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. I mean, it's a pretty pathetic attempt we to a tie me to the bed. We found you. We had to take precautions, you know, just in case. It's understandable. No need to explain. Like you said, I was in pretty rough shape. Yeah, to say the least. It must have been tough out there for the both of you. Anyway, I didn't mean to scare you. Just being cautious. Sorry if it came across the wrong way. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. Come on, let's go see your boy. Hopefully he's eating and he's happy. He's having a nice little nap. I feel like he deserves it. I'm still annoyed that food was rigged. Like, why? Such a dick move. I'm glad I killed that couple now. So you've been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself. Don't usually see people our age alone out in the wild. I get sure, by. I do what I can to get by. No matter what. And don't worry about it. We all do what we have to. Good, we found you when we did. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. Walkers were on the way. The car, was it totaled? Yeah. Fuck. 
Had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. I appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. Hi I've there? I've seen some rough scenes. <laughs> uh, hi there? <laughs> What's his problem? You're just new. We haven't seen anything like you in... ever. What is this place? You can probably tell it used to be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well, I am. It probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but we do all right for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses, and a good location too. No one really comes out this way anymore. That is pretty huh. cool. Only kids. That actually sounds kind of awesome. You think so? Change position. I like it myself, but I'm probably a little biased. It wasn't always like this, though. There uh, used to be a lot of us, but... You know how it goes. Everyone dies. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. You and your boy feels like you both fit that description. Seems too good it's to be true. It's hard to survive too long these days without being a bit troubled. I was pretty good as a kid before everything changed. Made a lot of trouble since then. We all had to grow up fast. I'd say that goes double for your boy. It's been a little terror since he arrived. <laughs> Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. <laughs> at all. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Shit. I need to take care of this. Knowing Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. You got bigger fish. The kid's inside. Think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. Hey, get a move on, Willie. Where's your damn weapon? I like this place so far. Like in other places we visited in this Walking Dead game, you know when you feel a bit on edge. I don't feel as on edge as I have been with previous places. So, that's a good sign. Follow the music. Check. Alright, let's follow the music. Sorry, I had to go pee quickly. <laughs> I have a tiny bladder. Okay, find AJ. Master of fine ass. <laughs> Master of big ass. Juris doctorate of ass. Creative. I just want to make sure we look around everywhere. Don't want to miss anything. I think we came through those doors. Ah, you little motherfucker! Hey! Hey! Uh, About time you woke up! Your little boy just bit me! He's lucky I didn't take a boot to his head. Nearly took Doesn't a sound jump like him. I don't believe you. AJ wouldn't do something like that. I'm telling you, he would. And he did. And you've got the nerve to say you don't believe me? Screw you. What are you doing, AJ? <laughs> I'm assuming that's the way AJ is, but I haven't finished looking out here yet. I guess you can go up the stairs as well. Oh, flowers! These look nice. Even if they're fake. You never know when you're gonna need some flowers. They'll fake, but they'll last. Mm, nope. Music sounds like it's coming from this floor. Right, let's go find him. Maybe he'll like some flowers and that'll calm him down from biting people. So weird he would do that. Can't go through that door. Here we go. Clem! You're okay. <sighs> I was afraid you were. No. I'm okay. And you know what you are? What? Ticklish. 
but... AJ, listen to me. That girl out there says you bit her. Is that true? Answer, Answer me. me, AJ. Did you bite her? I didn't mean to. She snuck up on me. Still, no more bites. No more bites. <laughs> You're not dead. That's good. Watch your kid for you. This seems pretty My cool. name is AJ. Excuse me. Thanks. I appreciate it. No problem. Well, not no problem. He was a bit of a handful. <laughs> but I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. AJ doesn't like people coming up behind him. Don't ever do it. Because he will Loud bite you. Clear, little man. It's understandable. Thankfully, I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. I'm Lewis. Clementine. Oh, yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got it. A lot of empty cans around here. <laughs> um double um <laughs> does he know what that is it's dirty clean it maybe later back you go where it belongs dude that can't be a good idea that thing's bigger than him is it actually loaded he's a better shot than you he's a better shot than you hey <laughs> <laughs> you guys do your thing, I guess. You don't know any others? Well, there is one. But you're armed. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling Clementine. <laughs> lost and gone forever. <laughs> I love that song. <laughs> AJ loves it. <laughs> like a fairy, and her shoes were number nine. Herring boxes without topses. Sandals were for Clementine. <laughs> what do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud. It is. Loud is bad. Not always. Come press this key. Come on. This one right here. Go and give it a Go try. Go ahead, AJ. Press it. Oh, he's so now cute. Now press this one. And this one. <laughs> You're a natural. <laughs> hey, have you seen Rosie? Nope. Shit. Got a bit of a situation out there. Um, <clears throat> hate to ask you just coming to and all, but could really use a hand. You up for taking out a few deadheads? Deadheads? Just call them zombies. Get your, Get your Walkers, gear. deadheads. <sighs> Fine. Unfortunately, guys, I'm gonna have to end the episode there, but do not worry, there are two more parts to this episode because it's two and a half hours long. The next episode and the one after that, drama, it gets insane. Shit hits the fan. So get ready for that. If you enjoyed this episode, remember to smash that like button. If you haven't already, hit subscribe and the notification bell. It's free and it really helps the channel out. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Just run away with my time.